welcome back to another video. So I'm going to do a set of nails for um, England football team because we are killing it at the minute. I'm just praying, praying <laughs> by the time these nails go out, we haven't been knocked out. <laughs> but fingers crossed, we'll still be in. My nails are looking a bit tatty, but I'm not bothered. I'm going to do um, a set of football nails. I've not got a clue what I'm doing yet. I've pulled out some colours. i pulled out a black and white. I'm going to need to paint these nails white. And obviously I've got red because it's England. I might do a bit of a green football pitch, I'm thinking. And I've got a blue. These are all Umix, as you know. As you all know, I've slowly been swapping all my colours over to Umix. I love them. So that's what I've pulled out so far. Um, Sarah from Pumpkin's Nail Station is also doing a set for England so I will leave Sarah's video in my description box so you can go over and check out what she's done just a fun set Um I really wanted to do a football set but I didn't want to jinx it but it's a bit of fun isn't it so right I'm gonna start I'm gonna give all these nails a coat of white and that's as far as I've got I haven't got a clue what I'm doing so let's give these a coat of white and we'll take it from there. <laughs> Right, that's then had two coats. I've pulled out some of this glitter. It's called Cruella from Sparkle Supplies. And it's just a black and white hex mix. I'm going to use some of the big hexes in black and white. And I'm just going to do, make it look like a bit of a football. Just, I'll show you. I, I know what I mean in my head. You know how you get footballs that are black and white? <laughs> I'm going to do that. So, on the two nails that I'm going to do that, I'm going to give a quick base coat. So I'll just give these a quick base coat and I'm going to leave the base coat wet and I'm going to put these hexes into this wet base coat. Right, that's them out the lamp, so I'm just going to give these a generous layer of top coat just to get these hexagons sealed in because I want to paint on these nails as well. So I need a flat surface, so 
Nice generous layer and I'll get them cured in the lamp again. 30 seconds. Right, that's them out the lamp. I'm just going to give them a quick matte top coat. Because I like to paint on a matte a matte surface than a shiny one it's much easier so I'm going to cure that for 30 seconds as well and I'll do the same on the other one as well right I've left this middle nail shiny because that's going to have a coat of red look at this red it's a proper luscious red I don't know why I painted this nail white well I do because I didn't have a clue what I was doing <laughs> And now I've changed my mind. So that's going to have a coat of red. Look at that. Luscious. I nearly said a naughty word then. We all know what kind of red it is, don't we? Right, that's going in the lamp. 30 seconds. Right, these two nails that have got the footballs on. I want to do the England flag in this half that I've left blank. So I've put some red on my palette. And I'm just going to do a little bit of an England flag. So we will start with the vertical line. This is a new brush, I'm not quite used to it. It always takes me a while to get used to a new brush. Right guys, I think I'm going to speed this up because, as you can see, it takes me a while. Right, that's both of them cured. I've just put some of this number 213. It's a silver from Umic. And I'm just going to use this silver just to kind of separate the flag from the football. I don't want a straight line. I want it kind of scraggedy looking. Again, I'll put some music on and let you watch because... I'm so slow at freehand, I really am. <laughs> Right, and this middle nail, again, I'm going to give it a quick matte top coat because I want to write on it. Again, a quick matte top coat. And again, I'll speed this part up because it's more freehand. I don't know why I do this to myself. Especially when the time is 10 past 10 at night. This set's going to take me at least another hour. <laughs> dedication, guys. Dedication. Right, let's get that cured.
right guys this is where we're at oh my screen's locked sorry um i've got some of these little red gems very sparkly and i'm going to put them on this plain nail so just a couple i was thinking of doing a cross with the gems but no it'd be too much this set's already busier than i wanted them to be so i'm just gonna stick these gems into the top coat Right, I'm going to get the rest of these top coated. Now, I was going to leave them in matte, but no, I think we'll go shiny. I think we'll go glossy. I might have to give them two coats of top coat because they're a bit, this silver area is a bit lumpy bumpy. But we'll see. It might be all right. Right guys, that's them finished. What do you think? I quite like them. I'm loving this um, football effect. I wish I did that on more nails now. I really like them. Come on England, bring it home. <laughs> um, don't forget guys, Sarah from Pumpkin's Nail Station. She's done a football set for England as well. Um, Sarah's video, I'll leave it in my description box or I'll pin it in my comments. It'll be there anyway. So please go over and see what set Sarah's come up with. Um, just a bit of fun really I'm hoping it's fun and I'm hoping I've not jinxed our team now <laughs> but um, yeah I really like them I do anyway guys that is it for today I hope you enjoyed the video if you did please remember to give it a thumbs up subscribe to my channel <laughs> hit the notification bell as well so you never miss an upload and hopefully I'll see you all in my next one take care bye